What up, nerds? Yeah. Well, we had today off. Oh, ground two. My wife and I both. I was like, I it's Matt and Kyle. Uh, we'll go where the Hydra and tap it for yeah. a. Come here, spirits. Yep. Yeah, okay. I will put a stomping ground. Is that only land? Land and enchantment. enchantment. Okay. And then I'll pass her. Sounds like you're doing shenanigans. No, no, no shenanigans. Gifted either. Pass. Made a couple changes this morning, even though I haven't bought any new cards yet. Stopping ground tapped. We will pay one as many people rock. We'll see what happens. Oh, Vanessa. Mm -hmm. Stopping ground. We will grab a Berkey. Make him a man. And. Cast the draw card of his life. Yes, I'll talk to her to my library. Oh, yeah. play yeah. Yeah. And steal my next <laughs> hand instead. Go ahead. One each. Attack for two. I will take two. 21. 18. Candy shirt. Yeah. Yeah, good. Yeah. Yeah. Appreciate you. Yeah. Uh, it starts, oh. <laughs> you will. Guys, it's already going there. To cast Steam Clean. I'll turn target now and permit to don't change. Tap two, and we will play Azure. Bunch of everything over here. Yeah. I don't even know what half of them do. I assume you do shenanigans with Bergie. Although. Take the Bergy. Um, uh, it's exiled, right? No, it's just discarded. <coughs> um, do you want me to write him down? Or play uh, so whatever you want to do. I said we can keep him face up. It's quicker that way. Um, then I'll pass. Okay. You can put him back yeah. towards your hand if you'd like. <laughs> Yeah, I was just trying to figure out where I want to keep them, yeah. how many, or what's going to get played right now. So we're going to go ahead and tap two. And we're going to play a three. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this taps for mana. And it's plus two, plus two, and it's access to four. And you do not have a blocker at the moment. I don't. So we're going to tap green, colorless, and a red. I'll replace some butts. Okay. And go to combat. Let's see. I'm going to reach your control because combat is a Okay. Yep. 
So swing three. Okay, 21. Uh, I will draw a card because I enter this turn. Yep. And then I will pass turn. Whenever it attacks, I'm going to discard, right? Yeah, whenever this attacks, each opponent discards a card for each opponent who can't you draw a card. That has to do combat damage to you. Field, no, I do not have reach. I'll attack him back on. So trigger uh, on the attack. Geez, yeah, please. I'm gonna go ahead and discard Xenagos. Four, four in the air. Oh, just right. the four. Take four. <laughs> go to twelve. Go to twenty-five from my flank. Yep. Let's see. Trespasser. Uh, oh yeah. Yep. Exile the uh, Bergy. So you'll lose one now. I should go one. I could have sworn I had four. I had three. I may have a fourth one. Daytime. And then I mean, it's a fifth set of cows. The drill night. Well, they get the car back from one south side. <laughs> Still daytime. Right now. Sure. Okay. He's in there trying to talk me into like sixty dollar dice sets. It's a god, this is so cool. I can play land yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah, they are. What am I doing? Super, super cool. Okay. Well, keep kind of. Yeah, I'm not very responsible. Yeah. Pass turn. Yeah. Pass? Yeah. They did have some pretty sweet dice boxes. Like, oh, okay. What's the back side do? Uh, still ward, discard a card, and when it attacks. Or enters, it's two cards. Okay. So it's two cards. Draw stuff. Start to take it a little more serious. Yeah, I'm still not sure. Um, I'm sure. Draw a card in those legs. Yeah. So, yeah. Like, I don't think this will be this thing. I think I forgot to write down something. I'm okay. just going to leave it at 24. Okay. I, I think I forgot to write I, down I'm the gain life. I said, I'm gonna be honest, I don't think it's going to matter in the long term. Yeah. Um, I'll go to combat and yep. attack. Trigger, I will hit. Uh, I guess both of your cards. There's no. Yep. It's not a creature. So. Uh, I'm going to discard uh, Tarkar. Yep. Uh, oh. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Then I will hit. I will, yes, I will uh, stack them so you discard then. Oh no, it needs, it needs, it needs targets, you're fine. Okay. Yeah, because it, it needs targets yes. on the trigger. Okay. Yep. Um, so uh, that is a. Two four fours. Two four fours. Hey, I think this is the one that gives me the best chance at getting a couple more draws, so we're gonna block there. Okay. 
And then I'll take four, seven. I know my life total is wrong, but I'm just gonna roll with uh, 28. Uh, second main. Play that. Pass. Untap. Draw. That is not what I want to see. I think you just got it. You got it. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Four blue chronoses in me. That was a, I'll say a very, very timely thought yeah, It was. Cool. That was my top deck. I'll be honest though, I wasn't gonna be playing super. I was gonna be playing Bernie from the other side of it. Oh, I don't even know what the other side is. It's uh, discard a card. It's top two cards in your library. You can play on this turn. Gotcha. I just assumed you were like casting enough small spells that you just want to. Uh, not yet. I was gotcha. not near near that point yet. Probably should have mulliganed my first hand, but my opener was the Dread Knight, the Mac Lazats, and five lands. <laughs> so I was like, eh, I can play the Mac Lazat. Unfortunate. It was a one land. That was not dual color. Land for turn. Tap mm -hmm. two. Hard class. 
Legendary creatures enter with an additional 1 1 counter. You level it up, it costs less. You level up again. You get to. Uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, and. Pass turn? If you don't, you have to. I'm just going to get a card. Choose no card. Yeah. So, you said, I'm going to send you stuff. I was just going to send you stuff. Or the spell physics. Yeah. Okay. That was what I was laboring under the impression. Yes. But, I mean, Golden Rank throws you was the last thing I needed to win. Because if you, because the copy resolves first. That bounces, the and then the, this one will fizzle in the Tap two. Uh, level this up. Mm -hmm. Ideal. Level two. So my legendary, co my legendary spells cost specifically right, one green or and or one red less. I, I was thinking of... So the question is... Let's recast the I forgot that. Is it that you have to recast the mage? I think it's far better with that to mage. I'll I'll pass the turn. <laughs> That's neat. Yeah. Figured it was there. Sometimes I wonder why I play that. Stop. <laughs> I think that's fair. Um, I'll draw a card loose. So, yeah. Let's do it the proper way. My, I'm targeting to loot with all the Alright, pass. Cool. So, Brandon, we'll see if we can do a thing. Draw for turn. We're going to play. Ruby? Yeah. <laughs> play Mox Amber. <laughs> We'll, Tap we'll five, sure. level up bard class. Uh, so then mm -hmm. let's pay two to cast the Scalded Bard. And attempt to do things. Golly. I have no responses. Yep. So. Uh, I have not played a land for turn. Land for turn. Tap one. Clopus. Uh, go to combat. Uh, exile top oh, two. Okay. So I'll pass. Othenissa. Exile <laughs> top two. How are you playing those? Well, you're so scared missing? of his Legendary spells. spells. Oh, is it spells? Okay, yeah, I thought it was yep. creatures. No, so, and then I look at the top three. Uh, it, it makes better sense this way right now. So I will grab a ruby. It's in my hand. These two go to the bottom in a random order, but it's really not going to matter because uh, I'm pretty close to not being able to fizzle. So... We will play a Ruby, Exile 2. Uh, uh, this Ruby is sacrificed. Sorry. Legend rule. Uh, we will play a Ishquith, Firstborn. Uh, I will not trigger the thing. We will Exile 2. Jeez, it just wants me to have Ruby. Um, float a red with Ruby. Play a ruby. Exile two more. <coughs> There's more Goro. Um, we will play and float another red. Exile. I don't know why. There we go. Exile two more. Unfortunately, I'm not the man to play. The mirror box before it is relevant. Yeah, it's uh, unfortunate. It's even more so. Uh, we will pay one. Play the Goro Goro. Another two. Okay, there's a Hajar. We'll play a Hajar. 
Uh, not Verdi out. So we will exile two more. So, and Zergo, yeah, go ahead and play Zergo, exile two more. Uh, Ovia, we'll go ahead and play Ovia, exile two more. There's a Mox, we will put a Mox Amber, sacrifice the tap Mox Amber. We will tap the Mox Amber for a, for a red. Um, but I played a Mox Amber, so we exile two more. Agatha, we'll play the Agatha. By the way, all of my creatures are entering with an additional 1 1 counter. Um, just gotta give them haste. Uh, that's the so I have that. That's the the goal. Oh, I'm okay. Floating then we'll go to the next. Okay, one. I'll say yeah. At this point, I'm just gonna flood out all my creatures, give yeah. them haste, and swing on that. So I bottomed a Terra Sunder because I didn't know what you were playing. Yeah, that makes You're sense. You're just playing a bunch of creatures game one. Yeah, because I'm like that's so that's what I need. I need the Bergy to dig for the Bard class. Gotcha. And you hit the Bergy out. I'm like, it's a, it's a target. I know it's gonna get hit, but at the same yeah. time. Oh yeah. I show the other one as well. Doesn't matter. And the problem with that that game was I knew I put um, when I grabbed the uh, what was it I grabbed with the I just wanted to I grabbed the land with the um, Oh, Nissa. I put a Bergy in the bottom. I'm like, oh, God. Oh. So I, I'm like, now I know. I got I to at least dig to find, to find that one. What did the thing? And I did it. I think I turned four to it, so I think it's the fastest I, the fastest I can do it. It's probably not going to let you do it again. I mean, it, if I just draw lands, I don't have much to <laughs> not say about it. I'll say it really depends on draws. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I bought him Terra Sunder because I didn't know what he was doing, and then he played Bar Class on two, and I would have been able to Terra Sunder it. I, I, I'm assuming you didn't have thoughts. He's an opening hand. Uh, I did, but yeah, cause there was like I said, there was no. Yeah, you weren't sure of anything else. You no reason. I, know, maybe, I might have drawn it on okay. turn two, but there was no good efficient way to do it because it's like I can thought seize or I can play a creature. And so that's why I was. All right. There's a lot of combos in there, but Bard Quest is number right. one in certain. Move to discard. Yeah. So <laughs> the uh, I, I was looking um, at my choices, and I'm like, do you have? I know you have thought seize. I'm like, you are. You basically said you had thought seize in hand. We're like, there's no good way to do this. Right. So I'm like, do you have a kill spell as well? Because I'm like, I could just play out right now both Ruby and the, the uh, mobs. I wondered why you didn't. Because I was like, if you have a kill spell, you might also have the Terra Sunder. Yeah. And then maybe you just blow up the, I mean, you could you could have blown up the Ruby and the Mox, and that would have still sent me back two turns at least, which you could have hoped to then get back into it. So I said, it may have been the wrong play. probably was the wrong play. I probably should have just played them out. And force you to have the the removals because yeah, yeah, I mean you're you're cruel. No girl, sorry, Golgari. So you have the pushes. I just haven't seen any cut downs, yeah. maybe. All right, that part of the cards. I'm a lot all the time. <laughs> Have you seen the new Quintorius deck? I haven't looked at anything new. So, I've been really bad about I haven't even read over the whole Ixalan spoilers yet. So the Quintorius deck plays no no cards below three drop. The only four drops are three different spells that all create copies of target permanent or play, creature points or you control. And then the purpose is you uh, discover, you, there's a... Uh, the four mana Blood Braid Elf. Well, no, you play, we're doing. Uh, you, you play Quintorius, and you try to ramp into Quintorius, play Quintorius, and then his, like, negative I'll ability is to, um, I'm going to pull for no moments. Uh, his uh, down ability is to discover four, which guarantees you're going to hit a um, copy creature, which copies him, and is a color card cast from Exile. <laughs> to cast Seek the Beast? Okay. So much. Uh, but basically, it can win from an open board. Because you play that card, you just discover into your combo and win. 
And then there's also the, uh, what was it, the Trumpeting Carnosaur, or whatever the one that has a three mana discarded deal three damage, <laughs> which has discovered five. Uh, pay two. Which you play, and I discover into the copy creatures, which copy into either it until you discover it, then into Quintorius. Triple? And it's just this whole thing of Bounce. creating these copies and draining people instant, like, death from. There is interaction with it, but very well. We will bounce the target. Lucranos. And we'll target Hydroid. That's the target as well. Okay. So I'll take one from the Sully Viper. Mm -hmm. And then the Crasis and the Viper. Guess I'll try it. Oh, no. Is that yeah. turning yeah. it first? Uh, so, this fizzles on him. Land with a basic type. Mm -hmm. Land with a basic type. Okay, so we'll go ahead and grab a. So it's at the bottom. And it comes onto the battlefield untapped? Uh, uh, or it would just comes onto the battlefield. battlefield so I am not going to pay the two yes. so stop around. And Then I'll pass. Man, I cannot find land in this game. Spells of control okay, can't be yeah. countered this turn. Pay red. And I'll play a turn Draw. Mm -hmm. And then I will. Pass her. I'm on a card. Ah, go ahead. I got this. 
I'm hoping. Um, so let's. It really doesn't. Um, we're going to start by paying two to cast Steam Clean. Okay. And, and trail number two. One, two three, There's all my land. Mm -hmm. This is a two tapings. Cast stop. Um, six. I'll pass. Okay. I'll tap. Draw. I will play a. Now the bugbear is not for turn. We will. Up to the green. Floating a red. Um, so <laughs> I did it. And I mailed my Probably better split. Yeah, so. Yeah. Ooh, this stuff. Uh, Tap four. Yeah. Plus the floating yeah. for a. Some it? Was it a set? Yeah. Uh, flash, double strike, vigilance, haste, other creature control, have haste. Yeah. 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 Go to combat. Push that. Okay. Uh, so in combat, swing a 4-4 four, four double strike. And it drew so you draw it away. 4-4. Oh, could you check on that? Yep. Yeah, the passive ability. Yep, the passive. So, okay. Uh, and then I will pass turn. Do you want to check down again? Uh, so do the first one, one, then mill 7. Then Minus 2 is fight, right? Seven. Yep. It is put all the treasure. You don't choose. I put all three. I'll do this. I thought you should. No, it's all. Okay. No, that one's put all. It's all. Okay. Yeah. It's all. That's what I So then, yeah, I guess it doesn't work. Yeah. I mean, you should You should theoretically do that anyway. You should resolve one. Yes. Good. Well, or if you were to counter the second or third trigger, I mean, that would be good. Yeah, yeah. No, that was wrong. That's game over. Oh, okay. Blouses. <laughs> so Garrison, either we'll play each other or one of us is probably going to have to buy. I'll try. Three, two, we'll trade. I just. <laughs> okay. Around. So I will. Well, you end up playing each other, though. I have to play each other. One, four. I will activate uh, yep. the bugbear, go to combat, yep. I will swing both, trigger, make a oh, yeah, I'm sorry, goblin, it is a 2-2 two -two goblin, uh, a 4-2, so uh, 13 all together, so 4, 8, 12, 13. Two and eight, correct. Uh, yes. So I'll block the deck. Okay. Yeah, they'll try so I go up yeah. to 17 and then down to 7. Yes. No, I want to grind without. Did you say your deck was the last card? I drew my last card yeah. on the last turn. Good oh, that was hard. Yeah, that was bad. No, he's a two-three. Right cool. It takes me like twelve turns to get going. I cannot find a removal spell. Those are <laughs> not like, double. First, I couldn't find lands. Then I couldn't find removal spells. Because or now of, I can't. Because of double strike, unfortunately, it's not right. quite. I guess it technically could be with a double block. Yeah, a double block gets me there. I lose both though, but. I still believe it's got Captain Carol's one of the best in the world. It's got Titan of Industry, it's got World Breaker, it's got Ulamog. I can't pump my creatures. It's just a big roast that he's got. Yeah, I was playing it last night and I should probably put this and just get this moving. 70 mana at once? Up this. It also has two layer of the hydras in it. That's going to be red, occlusion for colorless, and then a. I originally had one layer of green. Clothus is not a creature as I have a devotion of six. But uh, 
Starting next turn, game pre comment main phase. Exile uh, card from graveyard. Those a land, add red to green, otherwise I gain two life, and I'll do two damage to opponent. And. Yeah, I guess I just keep swinging. We'll go ahead and do it. So that's a 4 4, right? It's a 4 4 double strike, yes. So if I double block. You kill one of them off of the first strike damage and hurt the other one's trade. Yes. yes. So I will do that. Okay. I will gain two life from the one that survives into second strike damage. Yep. And I will take one damage there. Uh, two. So two damage there. So it's, it's a wash and yep. it's both these. Yeah. Basically, it's just a creature trick. So. so it's kind of like a removal spell. Yeah. Um, and then I will pass turn. That's brilliant. That's what I wanted. Yeah. Clarify. We're in the grindy yeah, bed, unfortunately. Garrison. Cool. Yes. Untap. Draw. Beginning my pre combat main phase, uh, I will go ahead and exile target card from a graveyard. I don't know if you have any way of recurring anything, but we're just going to go ahead and hit your gifted Aetherborn. And because it was not a land, you will lose two life, not gain two life. isn't a creature, so he can't be targeted by Domri, correct? That's correct. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I will pass turn. Discard a Seju. And Dom will take four. Make a back. I will go to nine. Pass. Untap. Nineteen. Draw. Nineteen. Exile another Aetherborn, and you'll lose two, and I'll gain two. Back to play. Domri for red, tap of main. I just need to get out, so Ruby. Sunset Domery, Shieldred of you. Uh, uh, token with Shieldred and Domery um, will die. Uh, go to 13. Yeah, Trigger a uh, discard. Yep, I will discard it first. I will make a bat. And you take 4, 17. I uh, will take 4, 4. Oh, no, you block Shield. Sick. 
second. I'll crack this. So gain three, mm -hmm. draw a card, gain two, and then Terrace under the Clothis. Okay. It's exile, right? Yeah. And then I'll pass. Cool. Okay. And then she'll see the 19. Draw. Pass turn. Oh no, I, I, it is in theory I could hit that bar class next turn. No, I was saying mine because I can board one, but. Yeah, I'll swing all out, trigger. Yeah, so I will discard a, well, sorry, I'll discard a box in there. Yep. Um, and what's the total? Uh, 10. 10. I know the nine. Part of the cards. More or less. I think, I don't know if the math's actually right or not, but probably isn't. Two, two. It's not. I'll crack this. I am more sure if it wasn't. Go to, go to 23, draw from Shieldred. Yeah. Um, also gain four from that. Yeah. Numbers don't matter. Pass. They're back. Uh, yeah. Untap. Seven. Draw. Yep. Hit a land. Have it at Could be nice. Um, I yeah. do this way late. You you hit the bard class the turn before it went off. Yeah, yeah. I, I figured I had to hit it there. I mulliganed a hand that I couldn't do anything with the bard class. Yeah, and, and after I that, the... kept the hand with... It was one land, and it was Seiju, and I didn't draw a second land, and the candy trail showed um, Restless Cottage as the only land. So I was like, great, so turn three I can do something. I, I definitely misplayed by keeping... I kept Clothis back longer, hoping I was going to hit something. I'm like, I should just made Clothis to board and started attacking with you face with it and I realized that mistake after I lost two creatures so I'm like oh cool. Gotcha. cool. Let me find out. Okay. 